Among the healthy options for food, fruit dominates the game, out-tasting vegetables and whatever this horrifying thing is supposed to be. It's haggis, and if you're Scottish, I'm sorry. There is, however, one fruit that is not quite like the others. It's the banana. We all intuitively know this. Each of us may eat a bowl of grapes or strawberries. We may grab a handful of blueberries or raspberries. Some may even on occasion enjoy a couple of apples. But no one, and I mean no one, ever says, man, I could really go for a second banana. One is always more than enough. Now, bananas do offer several benefits to the body. They can help your blood sugar levels, make your trips to the bathroom a bit smoother, and are good for your heart. In addition to this, they can be turned into some delicious banana bread. Yummy. So, bananas aren't all that bad. But they're not all that good, either. Here's why. Banana comes from the Arabic word banan, meaning finger. Thus, when you eat a banana, you engage in the act of cannibalism. Just kidding. But seriously, that's disgusting. You should start calling a bunch of bananas a hand. Use them for Halloween decorations. I'd be all over that. But the reason the banana is named after the finger is because they were, and still are, much shorter in some parts of the world. In fact, as you may have guessed, they were the approximate length of a finger. But this is also cursed knowledge. Why are these bananas getting longer? What are they reaching out towards? And who will stop them if they get it? Everyone's afraid of technology taking over, but it's a distraction of the plantain variety. In addition to this, bananas have about 105 calories in them. Few people are aware of this, but 105 is a very special number. According to Wikipedia, quote, 105 is a triangular number, a dodecagonal number, and the first zasal number. It's a sphenic number, and is the product of three consecutive prime numbers. If that isn't cursed, nothing is. Finally, in the long and dark history of bananas, there is a recent incident that has rocked the world. In the Art Basel Miami Beach, a banana was duct taped to the wall as a piece of art. This piece was then sold for $120,000. Yes, this really happened. But that's not all, because a man named David Dutuna proceeded to walk up to the banana, peel it off the wall, and eat it. When questioned, Dan made this statement, quote, Absolutely, I am not sorry, end quote. How did this banana wreak such havoc? How did it find its way into the hearts of men to be placed on such a pedal stool, bought for such a stupid amount of money, and then eaten before it could spend its day rotting on someone else's wall? No one is quite sure, because no mere man possesses such power. In the event that you were watching this video in your kitchen, make sure the bananas haven't moved. Subscribe to our channel and click this video.